This is InfoQ with some breaking news. Rod, I hear that you have a big announcement to make. Yes, today we're announcing that uh, SpringSource has been acquired by Microsoft. Interesting. Can you tell us some details of the transaction? Uh, the transaction, is Spr SpringSource is a private company, so um, it's not fully disclosed. Uh, however, it is uh, one of the larger open source transactions recently, um, and indeed it was larger than um, Sun's acquisition of MySQL. And what are the ramifications for the Spring portfolio? Well, clearly there are very significant um, changes uh, likely to occur because now we're able to work so closely with the Windows and the .NET teams. So essentially we're flipping our um, primary effort to be the uh, Spring.NET uh, project and the aim is that that will be fully folded into the next version of the .NET platform, in which case of course it will be distributed with every copy of Windows. Very interesting. And so this will be in the next version of Windows, you said? Yes. The, um, we're very excited about the fact that you know, Spring will be integrated um, at every um, level of both the .NET platform and indeed the operating system itself. Um, so indeed you will be able to, for example, customize your desktop um, through defining Spring bands. Very interesting. And does that mean that the next release of Windows could be dubbed Springhorn? Uh, well, I imagine that's um, something that will come out of our uh, colleagues in the uh, marketing group. Uh, so I couldn't comment um, on that. And do you imagine this will help with the issues that Windows historically has had meeting release deadlines? Oh, absolutely. I mean, clearly um, Spring has proven its value in terms of bringing in um, release schedules. In fact, I mean, I've already um, had some very positive conversations with uh, Bill around how we can uh, help to put um, Spring into all the code bases and help to improve manageability. Uh, so, for example, um, next week, uh, Jürgen's going to be in Seattle working with the office team, um, and we're really very excited about um, some of the things that we're going to be able to do in Word 2009 um, using um, Spring. And what about the ASP.NET? Will there be an introduction of Spring Webflow and Spring MVC components there? Oh yes, absolutely. I mean, Spring Webflow will become the um, standard uh, model um, for working with um, ASP. It will be um, fully integrated. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you.